Hi there everyone, this is Alex from Drummer Artistifer Studios. A few weeks ago it was Valentine's Day, and I decided to do something unique to give to my wife. Since I'm a prop maker, amongst other things, and both of us are huge geeks that both absolutely love Harry Potter, I decided to use a video I saw on YouTube from the channel Muggle Magic where he created the Wonder Witch products sold by the Weasley tw twins in their shop in Diagon Alley. So he went and recreated all the labels pretty much the way that they were shown in the movie and made a series of products from bath soaps to nail polishes to deodorants. He, he had a, a nice little run of stuff. I decided to do a limited run of Wonder Witch products, but because my wife loves mermaids, I made the Mermaid Collection. So I went over to the local Walmart and picked up a bunch of different bath products for women that all had a turquoise aqua blue color scheme to them. I got a deodorant, some nail polish, bath soap, hand soap, bubble bath, a nice little run of stuff that were all that aqua turquoise color. And I created labels to replace what was originally on the packaging. All of it is the Mermaid Collection. They feature similar color scheme to what's on the product themselves, but they also de are depicted with the stained glass window from the Prefect's bathroom that we see in Goblet of Fire. So it's got a nice stained glass look mermaid. And then I also went through and used Photoshop to create an image for a Honey Duke's Caramel Bar. Now down at the Wizarding World, you can actually buy a milk chocolate and a dark chocolate Honey Duke's Chocolate Bar. But because my wife also likes caramel, I went and got a Ghiadelli chocolate bar. I removed the wrapper and scanned it into my computer, imported it into Photoshop, and used that as a template to create a new wrapper for the chocolate bar. The design was based off of the actual Honeydukes bars, so that it looks like it could have been bought at the Wizarding World, but I changed the color scheme to look so it gave an idea of what was in the package. In the back of the package I also included uh, Diagon Alley and Hogsmeade labels to show where they had branches that you could buy the chocolate. So this was just a way that I wanted to create something simple but fun that I could give to my wife instead of just going to the store and buying something right off the shelf. I wanted to make it more personalized so that she could enjoy it. Like I said, I used Photoshop for designing all of this. I didn't do anything drastically complicated in any of it, really. You can do everything I did with just having some basic knowledge of cutting, pasting, using a few of the highlighting cursing tools to get rid of background images. Um, I have not been trained in how to use Photoshop. All the knowledge I have of it I got from tutorials or friends that have been taught how to use it showing me some pointers on how to work with the program. So if you guys want to make something like this, go for it, give it a try. So as always, thanks for watching. I'm Alex. This was Drummer Artistifer Studios. See you next time.